All right, guys, so we'll kind of like looking at a lesion, a type of lesion that is seen in diabetic nephropathy. This is what is known as a chemel stain, no, chemestial wheezing what lesion, chemestial wheezing lesion, all right? So here they actually describe it as what? Well. It's an ovoid or nodular decomposition, deposition, sorry, of a cellular or hyaline matrix in the mesangium. You understand? So there's a deposition of hyaline stuff in the mesangium. So that's what is called the chemistel Wilson lesion, all right? So we said that it's a specific type of what? Nodular uh, glomerulus sclerosis usually associated with diabetic nephropathy. Now, diabetic nephropathy, we looked at it and we said that uh, um, it's a type of nephropathy where there's like too much sugar in the blood, so there's now deposition of glucose. You understand, all right? So it's named after two pathologists who describe this as Paul Kimestel and Clifford Wilson, all right? So there's nodules of pink hyaline material. All right? See all those pink stuff? Pink stuff, pink stuff. They are actually different from the purple, all right? So there's also messenger matrix expansion. Then because uh, there's the position of these guys in the um, mesangium, the, how will I put it? The competence is now lost, you understand? So everything is now passing through. So proteins too are now passing through, all right? So there's protein in urine, there's hypertension. Then the kidney function is basically going down, you understand? So diagnosis is typically involves urine tests, blood tests, sometimes a kidney biopsy just to confirm the presence of the nodules. Right? Treatment just focus on managing the diabetes, blood pressure, using medications like angiotensin converting enzymes or angiotensin receptor blockers, and making lifestyle changes just to slow the progression of the kidney damage. Right? So this is it for chemistry. We've seen lesion. See you guys pretty soon.